polka is a really fun Irish tune. It gives us a chance to practice our slurs as well as picking up our fingers to get them out of the way. We're going to start by going D, D, then we're going to do stopped bows for our slur. So we're going to do a little down bow for B, a little down bow for C sharp, a little down bow for D while we pop our C sharp up, and then a little down bow for B. I'll show you what this looks like. Down bow on C sharp, and we've left our B down. Down bow on D, but we're gonna pop our C sharp the second we put our D down. And then one more down bow for B. Let's give this a try. B, C sharp, D pop your C sharp, B. Ready, go. B, C sharp, D pop C sharp, B. Let's try it once more. Ready, go. Let's try it as a slur now. Ready, set, go. Let's do it a little bit faster. B, C sharp, D pop, B. Ready, go. Make sure your D is down before you pop up your C sharp, otherwise we're going to hear this B. Let's try it again. B, C sharp, D, B, one, two, ready, go. I'll write a little bit faster. B, C sharp, D, B, one, two, ready, go. Now we can put it in the tune. D, D, B, C sharp, D, B, A, one, two, beginning, go. Let's try it again. One, two, ready, go. All right. Now we're going to go on. We have A, F sharp, A, F sharp. One, two, ready, go. It starts up bow on your A. One, two, ready, go. Let's go from the beginning. One, two, here we go. One more time and then we'll go on. One, two, here we go. Moving on, we have the same thing, except we're going to start up bow. So we go D, D, and then we fit all the B, C sharp, D, pop your C sharp, and then back to B is on an up bow, like this. And then we're going to go A, F sharp, E, D. Let's start in bar three, where it goes D, D on your up bow. One, two, ready, go. Let's try bars three and four again. One, two, ready, go. Okay, whole first line. One, two, ready, go. Okay. When we go into the second line, it starts the same way that the beginning does. D, D, B, C sharp, D, pop your C sharp, B, A, F sharp, A, and then we're going to freeze right there. One, two, ready, go. Stop. Let's do it once more, right to there, from bar five, and then freeze. One, two, ready, go. So for right now, everyone's going to start on the open D string. D, E, F sharp, D, E, then change to C sharp on your lower string, and then D, D. I'll show you. Violins and violas, that's a high three on your G string. Cellos, that's an extended four on your G string. And basses, it's a C sharp on your A string. Let's try this, D, E, F sharp, D, E, C sharp, D, D. Ready, set, go. Let's 
One more time. Ready, set, go! Okay, let's try the whole A part. Beginning, and one, two, ready, go! Let's do it once more. One, two, ready, go! Okay, for the B part, we're going to split up in octaves. Violins, if you want to give this a try reading on your A and E string, you're more than welcome to do that. Otherwise, follow along with us on the D string. Okay, violas, cellos, basses, and any violins that want to try, we're going to start by going D, E, that's at the end of our first ending in the A part. So up bow D and E, and then we're going to go F sharp, D, D, E, F sharp, G. So we have two slurs. The first is at the beginning, and then pick up, and then when we go, we're going to slur from E to F sharp. So we're going to go D, E, F sharp, D, D, E, F sharp, G, F sharp, E, D. Let's give this a try. Up bow. Ready, go. Let's do this again. From the second ending, the middle of the second ending, up bow. Ready, go. Moving on, we're going to go F sharp, D, A, D. Then we're going to slur F sharp to G, and then A to G. Sounds like this. Let's give this a try. The third and fourth bars of the B part. Ready, set, here we go. Let's do it again. One, two, here we go. No surprise, halfway through the B part, we come back and do the beginning of the B part again. F sharp, D, D, slur, E, F sharp, G, F sharp, E, D, and then we do the ending of the A part. F sharp, D, E, stretch or extend to C sharp, D, D. Let's try the whole B part. Violas, cellos, basses, and any adventurous violins. Ready, go! <laughs> Let's do it again. <laughs> 